Yeah, isn't that cool? Yeah. You don't need one. <laughs> this is really nice, guys. So you guys want to be on YouTube? Are you already? Oh, wow. Yeah, yeah. Amazing. What is it? What's the name of it? Uh, mine's Snake Boss 75. Okay. Mine's is it? Mine's like PSR cabinet, but it's a space in the kingdom. You see the key in two. Each boss is 22. Well, there you go, guys. Shout out to uh, uh, the guys on YouTube. Um, thanks, uh, thanks for watching, guys. This is another video, and we actually have um, this uh, all pink dump truck from Mr. Hal. Uh, Mr. Hal has um, a lot of trucks. I think he has probably like 25 to 30 different trucks, um, probably every color, every special edition. Um, this one here is a, a very unique one that I've been asking him to bring in because uh, I love all of his custom trucks, but this particular one he wanted to do all pink. Uh, so this is a fully, fully functional. This is the Tamiya. Um, do you remember, Mr. Hell, what the Tamiya, which one this is? I think the Tipper. Yeah, the Tipper. But I think it's like a, a Mercedes Benz, like six, six, eight. Uh, I forget the exact name, guys. If you, if you, if you know, then uh, just uh, write it down in the comments below. Um, so if you can uh, take a, a little bit closer look here, this is fully functional. This is the tipper, so he hasn't finished all the wiring just yet. He's still working on it, but this uh, uh, back part here um, lifts with the actuator, and you got the actual Tamiya, right? The Tamiya actuator? Yeah, so he's, I think, in the process of just finishing all the wiring for that, so that way this dump truck is gonna be able to tip right off of, um, you know, the radio. It's gonna be uh, really nice, fully functional. Um, really, really sweet, guys. As you can see, it's all pink. This is like a... Um, um, what is it? The is it like a special edition? Like a breast cancer. that? That's right. So it's the breast uh, cancer truck, right? Um, it's pretty nice. I mean, you have another one like this. It was the Ford, right? Yeah. Is yeah. it the Ford? Ford right. So the Ford Aeromax. Uh, also, you guys have in the all pink uh, color as well. It's also has it's cool. I like this little stuff, like this, the detail on that. It's nice. So this is for the manual tipper, right? Mm -hmm. This is to lift and... Uh, you have lights installed as well? Yeah. Does this take the multifunction unit as well? Yeah. Um, I have a pretty sweet bumper for back here, side note, but I'll show you that after. It's, this is, I think, the stock one. There's a really nice one that you... Oh, wait, no, you can't because this, it already has... Oh, okay, never mind. I was thinking that there's another one disregard that last uh, request there um, no it looks really good you did the inside black rocket guard oh this is like the the real rocket guard oh, the bed liner that's right the bed liner oh, really nice there she is all pink mercedes-benz tipper I'm assuming this is your favorite one, right? No, it's the wife's. <laughs> oh, this is the wife's, okay. All the pink stuff is mine. <laughs> you guys got a collection of RC stuff. Yeah, awesome. Yeah. Shout out to your Instagram. What is your Instagram? HJL Tire. HJL Tire, guys. Check out their Instagram. He's got all the trucks up there as well. Um, give them a shout out or take a look at their page. It's really nice, really cool stuff. Very nice. And we have a new, brand new Proline Racing body all done up in black, Tamiya PS5. 
and it's on top of the all custom um, Axial SES 10 uh, chassis and it's stretched it looks a little bit stretched out but it fits perfect look at the wheel wells it's nice so this body here is the ZR ZR2 and uh, it just got released from Proline Racing. I don't I'm not sure if this body was actually designed uh, for the wheelbase of a rock crawler but the wheelbase um, on this model here looks perfect as you guys can see it's nice Look at that, how nice that looks this is uh, this car belongs to my friend Darren uh, Mr. Darren, quick question, buddy. Uh, did you say you have the real truck of this one? Yeah, it's outside. Oh, there it is, guys. So he made his RC car look like his real car. And I think it's outside. Let's see. Oh, there it is. It's the exact same one. Oh. Looks exactly like the uh, like the RC. Yeah, should. And there's his RC car. Exactly like the real one. Really nice. Yeah, it's exactly like it. Yeah, it's really nice. Good job Proline for making this body. It came out uh, exactly like the real one. So you guys can see. Um, I'll get you guys the part number on this. Uh, let me go grab it. Part number. There it is right there. All right. Part number 351700. Cool. So, Mr. Darren, I think your RC car is all done. You have all the upgrades. You can't really upgrade anything else on it. Everything is completely done. Um, it's all ready for the. It's all ready for the springtime. So, you have all the aluminum links. Um, aluminum chassis Oops, you can see it there uh, beadlock 1.9s RC4 wheel drive tires these are the Proline are these the Proline right? Proline King Shocks? yeah Yeah. okay the Proline King Shocks are on there as well um, he has the Axial uh, I think this is a 20 turn motor he also has the Arma he's got the Arma ESC on there which I believe the Arma one works really really good yeah but there it is guys oh you got the two-speed as well oh nice two-speed transmission box on there you running a lipo oh lipo cool